can talk about the over Hyder Emil and Jun Young Lee fight first. Why do you have that as a gigawalk? Yeah, this fight, I think both of these guys have good skills. They both have grappling and striking down pat. Um, as for Hyder, he fights hard. He has a full mix of strikes and mixes in nice kicks and boxing. Um, he has solid grappling, but he mostly wants to strike. It's similar to uh, Jun Young Lee. He he can grapple, but he, he's loose with it. He likes to strike being loose. Hyder, he does have that dog in him. He's like, has that Steve Garcia trait to where he's ready to just stand in bang and get in, get dirty with you. Um, he keeps coming and he's ready for a firefight no matter what. And he leans on his chin, I noticed, in some exchanges more so than Jung Young Lee. So that might be something to see there. But I think, I don't think he'll... I don't think Hyder Emil will get finished. And same thing with uh, Jun Young Lee. Both of these guys are on winning streaks, and yeah, both guys haven't haven't been finished. As for Jun Young Lee, he doesn't take the same risks as Hyder. He he likes to pick his spots of when to get aggressive, and I, I think in this fight, um, Jun Young Lee has the edge on the grappling, but. I think Hyder will be able to defend the those grappling exchanges. Both have good takedown defense and I think I just think both of these fighters match up well enough to to a decision and not get finished in this one. Yeah, that's why I have the over two and a half on that those two guys right there. Nice. Um I guess like the only thing that kind of scared me about the over. Um, and you mentioned it a little bit, is that Hyder Mill does like to brawl. Um, and he relies on his chin uh, a lot. And he is hittable. And against a guy like Jung Young Lee, who he's huge and he hits really hard. Why, why do you think, um, how, you, you just think Hyder Mill will be able to take those shots? Yeah, I think I think he'll be able to take those shots. And I think J Jung Young Lee will also be kind of hesitant because he's going to see the aggression from Hyder Emil. So I think, I think it'll be like, I could see it being like a close decision of a pretty good action. And yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if there's a lot of cl clinch work around the cage. So that can also slow things down. Yeah, definitely. Um, you bring a good point. Like both, both fighters can, if they do get in trouble, they can, you know, lean on their um, grappling. And, uh, you know, we've seen uh, Jen Young Lee uh, pushed against the cage against a much smaller opponent. Uh, and obviously, Hyder Mill in his Dana White Contender Series fight was taken down a bunch of times. Um, but that was more so like a relentless pace. Uh, but yeah, I, I see your point there. Uh, I think both of them. Uh, are very tough and as you mentioned they can utilize their grappling um, grappling skills if things get a little bit dicey so now we're going to go with my best bet uh, and it's going to be an underdog and it's a fight that you covered it's going to be hider meal um one unit to win plus 160. so that's what i originally had to bet in as and what i alerted our discord members uh so currently it's at a plus 155 um so you know slightly better odds uh but i think hyder meal is going to win because i think he's the cleaner uh he's the cleaner guy in the stand-up uh, what i mean by that is his technique looks a lot better um he's able to string together uh, combinations much nicer uh, and I think he's going to be the guy that's uh, that that has more activity during the rounds um, now I think Jung Young Lee hits harder for sure like if you look at his uh, build his stature uh, super muscular super huge it's really hard it's like in that Blake Builder fight 
Blake Builder got thrown off because of that um, body shot in the first round. If you go back and watch that fight, that threw his whole game off because uh, Jung Young Lee hit so hard in that. It just, it just, um, he never really recovered after that one shot, in my opinion. Um, but I think Ider Meal is uh, very durable. And I think that, you know, he's just going to have, he's just going to have more volume throughout the rounds. And I just don't think that Jen Young Lee's shots will, uh, even though, uh, again, Ider Meal loves to brawl. I just don't think that Jung Young Lee's shots will uh, impact him the way that it did to Blake Builder. And uh, Jung Young Lee, he he's not a high volume guy. He's he's gonna bide his time. He's he's gonna be patient. He's gonna choose when to um, throw heavy. Uh, and so I think all those things are going to lead to uh, Hyder Emil uh, winning. And, you know, to be honest, I can even see Hyder Emil, you know, potentially getting a knockout just from having more volume. And so, like, people, a lot of people point to uh, Jung Young Lee's uh, grappling, wrestling, thinking that, you know, he could potentially have some success in that area. Uh, but from what I've seen of uh, Jung Young Lee, he doesn't, he's not an offensive wrestler or grappler. More or less, I feel like he waits for his opponent to make a move, and then he'll react to that move. And so, you know, I just think that, you know, I personally think that the fight will be mostly standing, maybe some cage push here and there. Uh, but, you know, I see Hyder Emil winning. And plus 160, I think it's it's still uh, really, you know, really good dog odds. You know, if I would if I were to line it, I personally, I personally think it should be like a pick'em. Yeah, I mean, I, I got Hyder Emil here, so uh, curious to hear what uh, what your thoughts are about that fight, Gerard. I know you picked the over, but do you have a winner in mind? Yeah, I think the thing is, uh, I think this could go to a decision, and it's kind of like iffy on the judges at times. Like, I think this can can be, become like a close fight. So I just went with the over two and a half instead of picking a side. But yeah, the Hyder Emil definitely has the value on his side. And in terms of the line movements, you can see that it's been going that way too. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, it, well, like you said, it, it can be one of those instances where uh, Hyder Emil has more volume, but uh Jung Young Lee has the bigger moments with the hard, the hard hits. Uh, so it could be a close split decision, decision victory. Um, you know, we'll have to see, but that's going to be my best bet. Uh, 